So it's Monday the 1st of February and January is finally over. I'm sure we're all really happy about that. Um, <laughs> it, the sun is shining for the first time in what feels like weeks. So I've kind of gone with like a pastel vibe today. I'm feeling it. Um, today is a pretty uni focused day. So I've got a lot of uni work to do. Um, I also need to gloss over the Staffordshire dogs that I painted. So I painted these up yesterday, um, but the paint is chipping away because it's just um, acrylic gouache on ceramic. So I need to gloss and seal them so that it all stays in place. I'm also going to look into digital listings on Etsy. So it was something I never thought about, but a lot of people have requested um, my planners and to-do list as um, an iPad file so that they can plan on their iPad. So I'm hoping to upload that today and look into like how much that should be and what other people charge for that. Um, and then I've got a few commission bits to send off. But overall, yeah, it's pretty uni focused. But I'll film the bits I can. So um, I bought us some Staffordshire dogs and these are tiny little ornaments. These are about 10 centimetres um, and I want to paint them up. So I got four of the mini ones and then I also got this bigger one. Um, so there's an artist called Amy Hastings Textiles who paints these up and I absolutely love them. So I thought I'd do some myself. Um, so I've used my iPad to kind of plan out my design on Procreate. So this is what I'm going for. Um, very colourful, very on brand. So yeah, I want, I'm going to use either acrylic inks and gouache to kind of paint the designs on. And then I'm going to find a way of sealing it. So yeah. you a little bit of a closer look at the dogs before I gloss them so these are a matching set they've kind of got like interchangeable colors on the ears I'm just gonna zoom in a little bit I drew the little faces on which aren't perfect but they are so tiny it was really hard to get any detail um, if we move them back got like a little star um, a fern got my classic flower you move them round. They've got hearts all over the ears and a cloud and a cherry. And then on the back, they have a little love heart, um, a strawberry, a moon down here and a smiley face. So I'll turn it around. They're matching on the back. Um, the bottom, I haven't signed off yet. I'm going to just do that just before I gloss. And then the front has little rainbows. And yeah. I'm really, really happy with them. Um, took me a good few hours. But yeah, for my first try, I'm very happy. Okay, so I've just um, done the digital. Oh, that's him. No. Um, so I've just done the digital listings for my weekly planner and to do list. Um, I just mocked up some quick Photoshop um, files. So I did these and this one. 
Um, so the idea is that you could download it and use it on your iPad if you like to plan on your iPad or you can print it out at home and use like it sheet by sheet. Um, the pricing is just like around £3 per file um, so obviously then you own it for life. So yeah, I thought that's a good like passive product to have. I have ordered myself some shoes. And I know this isn't studio related, but I'm quite excited. Um, they're the New Balance X Jaden Smith. Um, and they have like a really chunky sole. So, oh, um, so I wanted to get them because I'm really short, I'm 5'2". So I thought it might give me some height. <laughs> Ooh. Let's have a look. They're not heavy, you know. I thought the box might be heavy, but they're not. So they're white and pink. I really like them, especially with pink laces. But yeah, they're made from 100% recycled materials. So everything on the shoes recycled. You can actually see in like the sole, there's like flex. I don't know if you can even see because of the sunlight. But yeah, I'll try them on. Shoes are on and they're so cute. I wonder if I can get a, excuse my teddy. So cute. Pink or white laces? It's got to be the pink. Good morning. So it's Tuesday. Um, I've got a lot to do today. So yesterday was a really slow day. I had loads of things on my to-do list. And I kept adding things to my to-do list and not crossing them off. So <laughs> I have like a massive to-do list today. Um, first, I want to spray gloss my Staffordshire dogs. So I got this Rust-Oleum Crystal Clear Gloss. Um, it says it's suitable for ceramic, so we will see. And then I need to restock boxes um some of my stock i need to sort out a sample sale for this week and i need to do uni work so yeah it's a really busy day and i'll keep filming and you updated What leaks? My writing. Oh. Like she's crying. Oh. You might have sprayed it too close. No. Oh well, you know for next time. I think you yeah, have just sprayed it too close. Right, let's get inside, quick. Centimeters. Plant looks cool, but it's crying. Yeah, it does, it's not bad. Right, so you can probably see up there um, my weekly planners and to-do list are running out of stock. So I've got two big boxes of more stock, so I'm just going to stock them shelves up because if they run out and I'm packing orders, then it's going to be inconvenient, so I'll just do that now. shelves because at the minute this is living in the living room um, and taking over so much space. <laughs>
having a week. So yeah, that is the restock. Now I need to restock these um, shelves that I have pencils in. So the lilac has sold out apart from two. So I'm just going to restock them. is to make up the boxes so I've got about 70 here um, I'm just finding that when I pack orders the making of the box is making like it really inconvenient in a workflow and it's also taking me a lot more time so I thought if I had the boxes um, ready made and store them under my desk then they're kind of ready to go so I'm just gonna spend time doing this guys so it's basically nearly lunchtime and I've been doing uni work all morning and probably will for a couple more hours um basically we've been given a brief with uni um which is a branding project it's a six week project and we're on the last couple of weeks everyone gets given three words and you have to make a brand so my words were um immortality volunteering and social care and charity so I'm making a clothing brand, which basically the idea is that it's all clothes that are sustainably made and made from garments that have gone to get recycled so people can donate garments and they get recycled into new garments basically. And then with every sale or donation, we also donate to the local community. So that's like the charity front of it. Um, and with all my immortality it's the idea that like clothes live forever so yeah I don't know how well it'd work in real life but I'm just going for it um, I'm trying to kind of incorporate my style into it because a lot of the graphic design briefs that I do I have to feel like I'm not me with it I have to design that isn't the do designs that aren't like my aesthetic so this is one where I feel like I can now I'm gonna do like all colorful gradients make it like a brand that I would actually want to wear so yeah if um, I do anything that I like I'll uh, probably show it on my vlog but if not I'm just doing uni work <laughs> basically 5pm now and I've just been doing uni work all day um, 
but I've got a fair bit done and I've got a presentation tomorrow morning. So after tomorrow morning, I'll be able to get back to doing more like business stuff. Good morning. So it's Thursday, um, it's nearly 10 a.m. I've got a uni meeting 10 till 11.30. And then I'm gonna get on with some uh, business stuff. I'm gonna pack some orders. I've also got to do some drawing. Um, I've just hung up my little wall hanging there, which is really cute. So yeah, I'm just gonna go into my uni meeting. I've just had a very exciting delivery um, from GF Smith. So they have a collection book of their papers. So they're a paper company and basically you can't buy it or anything it's given to like businesses i know our uni has one um and i applied for one for my business and i've got one and i'm really excited so it comes in this packaging oh my god the packaging's even not really nice though um yeah i've used their paper to print on and to paint on and it's really really beautiful so let me show you the book and then you get kind of go through all the papers so the, the color plan papers are the ones i use um maybe i should move the camera a bit oh so the color plan papers are the ones i use um they've got bright white here natural i love pistachio park green i've used candy pink before and um the lilac so really beautiful papers Good morning, so it's Friday morning. Um, I've got uni until 12, I've got like a business meeting and I'm gonna get some logo work done. Um, and then hopefully this afternoon I can do some drawing and get some content for Instagram. I feel like lately I've probably been slacking on Instagram. Um, to be honest, I'm really not enjoying Instagram anymore. It's the algorithm. Um, I feel like I've stopped growing on there and obviously that doesn't like make a difference but my posts don't get shown to my followers so I've been using TikTok a lot but then on the other side TikTok doesn't allow my art because it thinks it's nudity um so I'm kind of like stuck I need a new platform <laughs> but yeah um I might try and create some content I need to paint and just be a bit more creative so yeah um I'll take you through my day but yeah, just business meeting and a hot chocolate for now. habit of kind of like recycling packaging especially if it's pretty um so from the package i got from um gf smith yesterday um i've recycled the box they sent me because it was beautiful so each side has this and this so i've just kind of recycled all the paper scraps and i thought these would be really good to paint on uh, draw on that one's got a bit of texture so yeah i got like a lot from the box it's really nice it's just past one o'clock um i've got like 20 orders to pack from the last couple of days so i'm gonna get that done and then hopefully get some time to draw
spent I just spent an hour packing all these orders and I forgot to film them. So you've missed the packing content. But here's the orders from Tuesday to today, Friday. Um, I normally just send on a Monday, but yeah, I feel bad if orders are waiting too long. Um, but at the minute with the pandemic, I don't leave my house. <laughs> like, uni's closed, so I work from home every day. Um, so yeah, the only time the post office, we go to the post office, is when Rob goes to work, and that's only on a Monday. So, yeah, I'm gonna make a special trip tomorrow when I do the supermarket shop, just to get these orders out, because I don't like people waiting. <laughs> so it's just gone three o'clock. Um, I'm gonna plan my Jasmineite designs because I keep putting it off, to be honest. I just don't feel like I have the time and it's not a priority, but it's Friday afternoon. I wanna give myself a little bit of a break and yeah, let's get creative. It's just lunchtime on Saturday and um, we got up quite early and we had breakfast in bed and then went and did the weekly food shop and posted some orders um, yeah so we've just put the food shop away I had to reorganize the freezer and then peas and carrots fell all over the floor and yeah so a bit of a disaster <laughs> um, so we're just cooking some lunch fish and chips and uh, yeah I'm gonna maybe paint today I really want to paint these, but I'm also really scared because if they go wrong, it's like a whole coaster wasted. I don't know, maybe, we'll see what I do. I did a couple of hours of uni work and now it's half free. Um, I'm just gonna try painting this one. Um, so the body is gonna be like this dark navy color. And then I think I'll do the stars yellow, but there's already a lot of yellow in it. So I don't know yet, but um, I'll film it.
Good morning, so it's Sunday, um, it's nearly 10 o'clock, I'm just staying in my chill clothes today and doing some painting. So I did some painting last night of the dishes which I'm sure you'll have seen in the vlog um, and there's a few I really like so I think I'm going to go along kind of that route. So first we have this one and like you can see all of the neon jasmineite in the body and then I painted the background um, I d didn't think I'd like the black lines but actually I think it works really well so yeah that was one of them this one's not finished yet um, but that's like a laid down gal I've got this one which is like um, alien babe vibes which I think is really cute yeah, and this one so this one has like cow print i don't know whether to do the background like a neon pink and then leave her with the marbled finish and then i might leave the background on that i'm gonna do some more today just see where i get and yeah I'm super excited because I've just finished the trays and I'm actually really liking them um so I did these two as like a matching set look how cute they are so that's a matching set I finished off this one so I made like stretch marks um I finished off this one I did a coaster set now I do really like these there's something missing but to be fair once I've sealed them it might just look better um so they're like a matching coaster set Morning. Um, 
I've been filming for about a week. It's been, do you know what? It's been a less productive week than normal. Um, I've just really struggled to get on with things this week, but it's okay. Like you've got to give yourself a break and you've got to allow yourself to rest. So I'll take that week as it came. Um, today I've got a lot of uni work to do and I'm going to spray gloss all of my jasmineite pieces. So I spray glossed one of them last night and I'm really surprised at how well it turned out. So jasmineite's normally like a very, I don't know if you can see, like a very matte surface. So it has no shine. Yeah. Um, but I want to protect the paint layer on it. So I used a um, gloss spray paint and I used a couple of coats and it's created like a resin-like layer and it's really beautiful. Um, so I'm gonna do that to all of them and then hopefully launch them for a Valentine's release. So yeah, thank you for watching my studio vlog. I hope you enjoyed it.